Nobody best Hunter Frazier. Nobody. Uh, I did. I can see that you exceeded my expectations, but we'll see how you fare at the Robo Cup. Who isn't invited to the Robo Cup? I'll see you there, Solo. That was very unlike Hunter. He usually doesn't concede anything. Next time we meet, Liv, you will be mine. Yo, dude, that's a little creepy. Like, you gotta be at least, like, what, 24? She's, like, 16? What a weirdo. I feel like I've heard Hunter Frazier use that line somewhere before. On behalf of the Robo Center, I'm pleased to announce the winner, Solo. I'm the best. Congratulations, Solo. Defeating Hunter was no small undertaking. Congrats. Yes, congrats. Good work. Thank you. You better give me all the dirt you have on Hunter Frazier. What? Oh, that? There must be some misunderstanding. We will now begin the award ceremony. Will the contestants please form a line? Coyote shows up at the RoboCup. Yeah, he gets out of prison. Third place in today's tournament is Tanya. Congratulations. You need to grow up, Tanya. You work here after all. You could have at least let Polly win third prize. It's not easy being a commander, and the earlier she understands that, the better for her. Tanya's really strict with commanders. Second place goes to Solix. Congrats. Thank you very much. I'd like to accept this award in his place. He regrets that he couldn't be here because of other pressing engagements, namely nap time. And the tournament champion is Solo. Congratulations. Hey. You won this trophy for reaching Neo Brain's Robo Cup Finals. Let's go. Congratulations, Solo. Yeah, congrats. How many times do I have to read the word congratulations? Solo will now go on to compete in the Robo Cup, along with most other people who were part of this tournament because they were already in, apparently. We have many people from this district fighting in this year's Robo Cup. I'm very proud of you and wish you all the luck in the world, Solo. The Commander Festival is now over. Thank you all for participating. Please visit the Robo Center again during our regular business hours. We, the staff of the Robo Center, will be waiting for you. Good work today, Solo. Back to back battles can get pretty intense, huh? Boy, am I tired. Fighting in a tournament is like going straight from sleeping to running. You did a good job, do a two at Dennis Words. That match you won was some great fighting. I'm impressed. Yeah, you beat some no name. Congrats. It's all thanks to you for helping me out. Oh, hey, it's my mom. It was interesting to me how, at their best, Robo Battles become something of an art form. <laughs> Do they? I can understand why everyone in our family is so enthralled with custom Robos. Good luck, Solo. I'll still be rooting for you from here. Oh, and Liv and Dennis, please keep an eye on Solo for me. I'd appreciate it. Yo, I'm like 16. You're letting me go to this island to do this tournament, like, without you supervising? Seriously? Of course. Before you know it, Solo will be Robo Cup champion. Oh, dear. Haha. <laughs> Look at the time. I have to go home now. Now, don't stay out too late, Solo. I'll see you later. Bye, Mrs. Geary. Goodbye. Well, it's getting late. We better get going, too. Hold it! Huh? Why is this loser again? I can't let you leave just yet. I have something for you, Solo. Think of it as a memento to remind you of me. Ew. What's this robo cube? It's my beloved Gigantron, the mightiest of all custom robos. I only give this to those who prove to be worthy foes. I'm trusting you to use this robo to work wonders. I'm never using this robo. Farewell, Solo. We shall meet again. Have you noticed that Hunter's personality is a lot like Marv's? They're both very, uh, assertive. You might even call them pompous and bossy. Oh, you're right. No wonder I dislike both of them. Well, Solo, it's gotten pretty late. Want to head home? Let's get out of here. And then there's not a nighttime activity to do tonight because we already took down all the criminals. Bow, bow. Bow, bow. Yo, what's up, Dad? How was the Commander Festival? I nailed it. That's the thing. Solo won. I was so impressed. Wow, Solo, you're really turning into a force to be reckoned with, aren't you? So this means you're going to the Robo Cup. Congrats. That's fantastic. This is only your first year training and you're already going. I'd like to participate in the Robo Cup at least once myself. I know that sometimes I worry too much about the danger of custom Robos. Watching your battle change my mind, though. Please know that I'll always support you. So, did you get Hunter Fraser's autograph, Mom? Haha, <laughs> I sure did. 
After the festival, I snuck into the VIP room and got his autograph. Oh, that sounds illegal, and I'm a cop. I'm gonna have to arrest you now and take that autograph as evidence. You did? Wow, that's so cool. You have to show it to me. Later. She looks so happy. Haha. <laughs> Tell my dad. He's not having a good time. Yet another fab meal. Bedtime. Nice. Hey everyone, how's it going? You did well yesterday, Solo. I'm proud of you. You're finally going to the Robo Cup. You're getting so good, it's scary. I bet you're the best commander in the whole world. Well, I don't know about this. You're going to a strange new place. I want you to be careful. Don't worry, Mom. The staff in Neobrain will take good care of them. Have faith, dear. Everything is going to be just fine. You're right. I'm sorry. You're such a worrywart, Mom. Don't speak to your mother that way tomorrow, or I'm going to get you fired from your job. And besides, she's right. Caution is a good idea in any new situation. Sorry, Mom. Oh, that reminds me. Our tickets haven't shown up yet. We're going to Encephalon Isle by ship, right? That's right, but we leave tomorrow, so I imagine those tickets will arrive today. Yes, let's all stop worrying and just enjoy this moment. Your father and Solo will be very busy, but we should still try to have fun. Wow, Mom, I never thought I'd hear you to tell us to stop worrying. Haha. <laughs> Look at the time indeed. Alright, so yeah, I don't remember what happens on this day, but next day we go to Encephalon Isle. Which, uh, kind of starts the end game a little bit. Oh, hello. Good morning, Sola. I know my sister has been causing you all sorts of problems, but I just wanted to say hello. Oh, and I received my ticket today. I assume that yours has arrived as well. You've had luck on your side for a long time, but that'll change when we reach Encephalon Isle. Yeah, yeah. I, I guess if the word luck means skill to you. I'm gonna take you down no matter what it takes. My stupid ticket never showed up. I bet the mailman stole it. Or those idiots in Neobrain just don't know talent when they see it. Well, I'm not giving up. I'm gonna find a way to go. Don't talk such rubbish, Polly. You're staying home and that's that. Yo, what's up, K-pop? Welcome to stream. Oh, Bull, what are you doing? Hey, Solo, you said sail tomorrow, huh? That Liv sure knows how to spot talent. I didn't make it this year again, but I think I'm finally starting to understand what Liv was saying to me. Go in, Solo. I'll be watching on TV so you'll feel my eyes burning into your skull. Don't mess up, or else. All right, that's super creepy. Oh, Solo, you know you really are something. From the first time I saw you, I had a feeling you were special. And yet, I never suspected that one of my students would be invited to the Robo Cup. Good luck, I'll be cheering you on. Yo, let's go. Hi. Hey, Solo, let's go see Duncan after class today. Remember Sling, that kid from Neobrain with the illegal parts? Kinda forgot about him, what with all the excitement around here lately. But there's something about him that's been bothering me. Anyway, let's meet up in the lobby of the Police Squad HQ. Hey, Solo, I got my ticket this morning, too. I'm gonna go look up info on any commanders you might have to face. Oh, and another thing. Liv wanted to go to the police HQ after class. We'll meet you there, so make sure you go, Solo. Alright, so we're doing... Talking to Duncan about Sling and whatnot to end up this day. Or to get through this day, rather. Was oh, this the third and probably final exam of the game? Good morning, students. I wish to make a brief announcement before we begin. As you know, several of our students have been invited to the RoboCup on Encephalon Isle. Liv, Dennis, and Solo, best of luck to you. I'll be accompanying you as a representative of Neo Brain, so feel free to ask me questions. And class, I'd like you to give these champions all the support they need. Now let's begin. Everyone put up your computers. Nope, no exam. Maybe there are only two exams in the game. I don't remember if there were two or three. Let's go chat with Duncan. Solo! Hello there, Solo. I'm glad I caught you before you left. Tomorrow's the big day, isn't it? The RoboCup is finally here. Oh, I wish I could go too. I can take my wife there for a little vacation and show her how brave and strong I really am. She'd lift that silly Robo Band in a heartbeat. Oh, but who am I kidding? I can't fight Robo Battles like you. I'd get crushed at the RoboCup. Well, fight bravely, and remember that my wife and I are rooting for you. Alright, sure.
Hunter. Ah, Solo, I can't wait to fight you at the RoboCup. I will have my revenge in Encephalon Isle. You have Hunter's word. Sure, whatever. Hi. He's here. Hey, over here, Solo. We were waiting for you, Solo. Hey, Solo, tomorrow's the RoboCup, huh? So why are you here? You should be packing and practicing and all that stuff. Sheesh. Oh, and Liv and Dennis are going with you, right? Yes, but there's something we wanted to tell you. What is it? Why is everyone looking so serious? Is there something on my face? Yeah, it's your face. We went to Neobrain a few days ago as a favor to Solo's father, and we met this kid who fought Solo with an illegal part. This is a serious charge, are you sure? We're sure. He's about our age, but he's a test commander for Neobrain. Neobrain doesn't have permission to develop military parts, and to actually allow a child to test them. Test them? Words? It's unconsciousable. Words? Liv, Dennis, and Solo, the whole gang's here. If the, by the whole gang you mean literally me? Sure. Chris! What's wrong? You guys look down. Chris, I've got some news you might want to know about. Mumble, mumble. Whisper, whisper. Blah, blah, blah. Uh oh. Thank you for that, Duncan. You're welcome. Thanks, you three. I think I understand the situation. Don't mention this to anyone. Do you understand? We understand. Even Solo's father doesn't know. Don't you find that strange? We'll check up on that, too. Chris will go talk to the boys upstairs. Don't worry, we'll figure something out. Speaking of which, Liv, have you spoken to Eddie? Uh, not really. He's staying over at the police squad dorm. Actually, he's here right now. He's in the training gym next door. He is? Eddie and Billy are helping the police with their training. You mean my brother's still hanging out with that woman? Ah! You know Billy? Uh, sort of. Did something happen? I mean, she is a little odd, but her robo skills are quite something. You don't seem to be too fond of Billy, am I right? You do know that she's entered in the RoboCup, right? A true fighter must fully understand his opponent. I know that, but... Why don't you go take a look? I guess we should. Let's take a peek, Solo. Thanks for hearing us out. Don't worry, we'll take care of everything. Hey there. Hi, Solo. I see you brought Liv and Dennis along, huh? I heard you made it to the Robo Cup. Nice job. Yeah, and we're going along as his support crew. I see. And that makes the three of you our rivals. It's literally just me. Those two have nothing to do with this. Eddie said I'm his rival. Oh, I think I'm gonna faint. Eddie, are you seriously calling these children your rivals? Listen, the other two are children, but I'm better than you? Haha, <laughs> you're too much. What was that? Why don't you say that again, huh? Liv, don't let her get to you. Calm down. Ah! Didn't you enter the RoboCup with your brother? Then you should know how strong the commanders are. You don't really think he'll win, do you? Ha, <laughs> such a fool. You are such a loser. Don't get carried away just because you won some petty tournament. Hey, that was uncalled for. She didn't have to say that. Well, thank you very much. That info was helpful. But you know what? We already know how capable Solo is. We're not going to lose to you or Eddie or anyone. Yeah, you tell him. Haha, <laughs> such hope. It would be wonderful to watch that hope get squeezed out of you. Alright, that's a little weird. Billy, live! Will you both just knock it off? Whatever you say. Lousy little. Dennis Solo, I'm sorry. Hey Solo, I think you have some real talent as a commander. Do your best on Encephalon Isle. I'll do better than you, loser. Good luck, Solo. I look forward to fighting you at the tournament. Come on, Liv. Cheer up. Forget it. Just forget it. You're a jerk. Yeah, he is a bit of a bad brother, isn't he? Come on, guys. Let's get out of here. Okay, see you later, Eddie. Good luck. Peace, losers. I have places to be. I want to get to Encephalon Isle already so I can buy new guns. Hey, Solo. Coming back from the training gym. So the rumors are true. You actually got a special license. Yeah, I'm better than you. Hey, Alunix. Nice to see the super losers are back together again. Stop calling us losers! Anyway, we're going to the RoboCup. Yeah, all three of us. I'd love to pound you right here, but I guess I'll wait for the tournament. Wait, what are you? I've beaten you twice, loser. See you at the tournament, suckers. Ha ha ha. Why do all of these losers that I've already beat keep talking to me? Oh, I hate those guys. They seem really excited about the chance to take on Solo. Hey, I've got
got an idea. Why don't the three of us have a RoboCup party? That sounds great. Let's do it, Solo. No. Come on, let's party. Yeah, she's right, Solo. This is gonna be a blast. No. Oh, fine. Illusion of choice. Okay, I'm gonna go home and get everything ready. You can come over whenever, Solo, but not you, Dennis. You have to help me set up. Fine, fine. Just one touch. I'd like someone to throw a party for me. Hey, loser! When you win a tournament and get into another tournament, then someone will throw a party for you. In the meantime, you're a part of the setup crew. Get over it. Hey, fight me. I'm having a hard time getting the diorama that I want. Maybe we should just fight instead. Bring it on. I'm gonna beat you down. Get in a little fight here and there for some extra cash. Oh, it went way over there. I think she got feet too. I totally could have gotten a good hit here. Still got a good hit. It takes so long to get up from feet. I'm amazing. Big damage, big damage. No whammies. Whoa. Oh, that hit me. Dang it, I was too focused on the robo. I wanted to try and get a perfect on this one. Come here, you. Come here, you. There's the hit I was looking for. Nice combo, nice combo. Nope. I'm amazed that when you got hit by that satellite, it didn't, like, stun you long enough for me to hit. Ow. Getting hit again actually makes me feel a little bit better about not getting the perfect. If I had only been hit that one time, I would have been like, Dang it, I was so close! Please let my dragon hit you. Oh my word. Ow. Alright, I don't want to get hit this much. Very cursed HP right now. Can you play this game on an emulator? I assume uh, Desimume would run it. You don't really need to use the touchpad for anything other than when you clean your robot. I don't see why you couldn't. I've never tried to because I've had a physical copy for as long as the game's been out. Yeah, ha, ha, ha. You ain't getting away solo. Not this time. Squawk. Not this time. Not this time. Oh, it's this loser. Why? I've been looking for you all day. All day. All day, all day, Squawk. Yesterday was a bad day for me, but today I'm gonna beat you good. You don't deserve to go to the Robo Cup. Undeserved, undeserved. What a phony. Are you ready, Solo? I'm gonna eat you for breakfast. All right, let's do this. Feast your eyes on this. Right, well then, easy way to get out of feed spot. You can use an auto clicker. If you're gonna like, I mean like, you can just, at that point, you could just be like, hey, what if I just like turn on the action replay and uh, one hit KO everything? Kind of defeats the purpose of the entire game mechanic. Nailed it. Also, I'd rather just play on my 3DS. Nailed it, nailed it. Oh, I pressed X too late. My perfect! I was so close, I really thought I had a perfect going on this one. Stupid bubble gun. It's a rough one to avoid. Yeah, that was the only thing that cost me my perfect too, rip. Double S rank though, almost 20 bucks. Let's go. Impossible! How can I lose? You lost, you lost, Squawk! Oh, you're gonna pay for this, you little punk! Pay, pay, Squawk! Ban a ban a ban. I just go into Lynn's house. Sup, losers? Yay, you made it solo! Everything's all ready to go! Hi. Make yourself at home. I know it's not much, but I've got some food and drink ready. I even made some of the food myself. 
And it actually smells pretty good, who knew? Quiet you, I cook almost every day, and yes, I'm good at it. Really, you are? Let me have a bite. This is good, Liv. Thanks. Oh, but wait, that one is actually from a mix. Oh. Anyway, tomorrow's the big day, huh? Yeah, no school or anything. Let's meet at the Harbor District Port first thing in the morning. Don't be late. Dude, uh, getting out of school is so consistent in this game. My goodness. Why is that guy in the house? That robot? That's like Liv's caretaker because she's like 16 and doesn't have parents. You shouldn't talk. Who's always running late for class? I'll be fine tomorrow, I think. I don't know. That's enough talk about who's late for what. Let's talk about you. Ever since Eddie left, you've been here all by yourself? Yeah, but I've gotten used to it. So did Eddie come back here? I heard he was sleeping at the police squad door. He came back home once. Well, that's good. What did you talk about? You know, just stuff. Stuff like how we used to fight battles with each other back when I used to dive. I was pretty strong. Whenever we got into an argument, we'd use our robos to solve it. You held your own against Eddie. Wow. Eddie didn't have a lot of natural talent. He became a champion by working really hard. What a loser. Just be born good like me. But look, I'm tired of talking about my family. Let's talk about yours, Dennis. Mine? Why? There's nothing to talk about. We're boring. Yet yeah, Dennis is boring. That's true. I live in a boring house. My dad is a boring businessman, and I'm just a boring kid. Very rude to say about your dad. My parents were worried because I've always been kind of scared, you know? When I got into Custom Robos after meeting you, Liv, they were practically crying. Haha, <laughs> I can see that. So, Solo, who in your family do you get along with the most? Uh, definitely my mom. Really? Your mom's nice. I'm kind of jealous. Oh, look at the time. We should get going. We gotta get up early tomorrow. Come on, Solo. Let's go home. I didn't even get to finish my... What is that? Orange juice? I had fun tonight. See you at the port and let's win. Man, that party lasted a solid 48 seconds. Of course. Good night. I'm so excited. I don't think I'll be able to sleep tonight. Maybe I'll count goats. You mean sheep? Ha, oh, yeah, ha, ha, I'm an idiot. Well, I'm gonna head home. Good night. Yeah, you're, you're an idiot, all right. 